Good morning guys, how is everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday, it's the 12th of April, already so soon, um, and I've just edited yesterday's vlog twice, uh, because the first time the computer crashed and the program had to close without me saving it. Oh come on, I'm trying to get the thing round. Um, but I thought I'd show you in good light the... Um, spinning that I did just very quickly because obviously you see it yesterday but um, I haven't actually seen it today so um, I absolutely love it it's really good it looks very like poofy and puffy uh, but I really do like it and I can't wait to give it a soak um, it's sort of it it reminds me of like vintage colors like vintage in not vintage vintage colours um, and I really like it. I'm possibly going to make something out of this because I did it. <laughs> um, so if you have any small um, projects that I could possibly do with this then that would be great. I could even make myself a little headband with it um, or something. I just want to make something that is quite small uh, because obviously yeah I just think there's not a, there's not a lot here. I've got I still got some on the um, bobbins to ply up as well to get the most out of what I've got. Um, so yeah, I'm really pleased with it, and I tried to get as much on this bobbin as I possibly could, um, and it just wasn't drafting up anymore because it was sort of getting a bit stiff going round. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm pleased with this, and I might try and see like obviously. It, once I've spun more and more and, and, and all that, I might see if I can get some more bobbins. Um, I'm, my friend may even be able to print them for me, um, but we'll see. I think they're cheap enough online. So anyway, that's that. But then I do want to do this one as well. This was the one that me and Mikey did. <laughs> um, and then this is the one that I did. So there's not a lot on there, but uh, there, there's quite a bit, I suppose. Uh, the thing I like about these bobbins is that they have markings on them. Let me see if you see, see this marking here that goes all the way around. That tells you that you've filled half of your bobbin. Um, and if you wanted to obviously do two of these and then ply them onto one bobbin, which I thought I did, but I obviously overdid it. <laughs> but it don't matter. It don't matter. I just spun the fibre that I had. So, yeah, um, this has got one minute left to go and then I'm going to upload it because I need to leave. Um, I need to be gone by 10 o'clock and it is 10 to. Um, so I'm hoping that it will be quick. And this is the yarn that I got yesterday. Um, oh, it's lovely. I love her yarns so much. It's from Woolly Mama. Um, Oh, squishy, squishy. Um, I'm going to take my socks with me today. So, I mentioned yesterday that I got my cosy memory blanket out and I'm going to put it into my rotation. So, I have changed my rotation a little bit. It was Harvest, Eyelet Burst, Daybreak, Ranunculus, C to C. I've changed it to Harvest, Eyelet Burst, Daybreak, C to C, Ranunculus, and then the cosy memory. I didn't want to put the cosy memory blanket next to the C to C blanket day because I thought that might just be too much. So I've split them up and put ranunculus in the middle. Um, so yeah, I thought that would be a good idea. Right, that is now edited and now it's time to upload and that way I can get my shoes on and get out the door. We're going to my uncle's today. Did I say that? Not sure. It was his birthday on Sunday. Um, so we're going to see him. Uh, I say we, me, Casey and the boys are going to go and see him. Um, so I'll bring you along. So now we're now at my uncle's. This is my uncle David. Say hello to everyone. Hello. <laughs> uh, so we're going to do this over here. And uh, yeah, did you have a nice birthday on Sunday? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, good. Good, so we're just FaceTiming my mum because obviously she can't be here. So we're going to do that. So go sit down and then uh, you want to sit here or do you want to sit on the chair over there? Oh, I should I think he's hit the signal around here. Do you right. try your phone? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy 
Happy birthday dear David. Happy birthday to you. So I'm now back home, um, had a lovely afternoon, it was really nice to see my uncle, um, I think he enjoyed us being there. We did go downstairs, because where he lives is like, he's on the second floor, but where he lives it's um, like assisted accommodation. I said, did I say sheltered before? It's assisted. So it's like a block of flats, um, well it's not even a block, it's like flats, and then um, there's like a communal area, there's the garden, um, and then they have like people working there basically. So yeah, um, and we went downstairs and there was like a foosball table and there was no ball, but I found a bouncy ball from when we went to soft play and the arcade the other day in my handbag. Um, this morning actually, um, I noticed it because I was sorting out obviously what I needed to take and stuff. And uh, so we played foosball with the bouncy ball um, and then a lady come along and she was cleaning out the fish so Mikey was um, looking at that and stuff so yeah it was it was a really lovely afternoon on the way back Casey got um, lunch for the boys um, and then I cut her hair straightened her fringe up a bit but she has mullered one side of it um, she normally has a fringe that comes across but then sort of um, goes down gradually like that um, but she's cut far too much this side and so we're just gonna have to grow it back and make it go in the right direction <laughs> and everything so but never mind it is what it is um, it's done now I can't put it back and I said that to her she was like it's fine uh, but me and Casey are gonna go to the gym tomorrow so on my membership I can take um, I've got four invitations I can take the same friend twice um, and Casey wants to start the gym with Mike um, and like I said, well, do you want to come with me tomorrow just to see like how you get on and like how you like it and whatever? She'll probably go to a different gym, but <clears throat> yeah, um, we're gonna go tomorrow. We're gonna be there at nine o'clock in the morning, so yeah. <laughs> um, I think we'll probably do an hour, come back, I'll have a shower, and I, I, I'll do some bits and pieces while I'm out. Um, so yeah, that's happening tomorrow. Um, on the way back from Casey's, I did go into Home Bargains because the last week or so, and this was before I see it on Ali from Little Drops of Wonderful vlog, um, I wanted a greenhouse, a little mini pop-up greenhouse thing. So if you watch Ali, which I'm sure you do because she's just lovely, uh, she has put a green, uh, it's like a metal framed greenhouse with a cover and zips. And I picked up one of those today. I was looking, they had them in Argos. Um, I thought they had them quite cheap on Amazon, but it was just the cover. <laughs> um, so lucky I didn't buy that because no frame would have turned up. Um, and when I was in Home Bargains today, I see one and I was like, that is exactly what I want because I want to start growing some fruit and veg. So here I already had a pack of seeds for like tomatoes, spring onions, cucumbers, uh, lettuce and stuff like that but I've picked up more today I've picked up um, a chilli pack and I've picked up some flowers as well like flower seeds um, and I picked up some other tomato thing um, it's all in the car I should have showed you while I was in the car but I put it all in a bag and it's all in the car um, and the greenhouse I picked up I picked up a shovel and I picked up some like netting because I've got a big box that I normally plant every year um, but the foxes and the cats get into it which is really annoying so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dig that whole thing out plant these little seedlings or seeds 
um, and I bought some compost seedling pot things that I don't need to take them out of that I can just put I can just plant that pot it's compostable so that's what I'm going to do I am going to put all these seeds in the greenhouse and then I'm going to transfer them once they're obviously a little bit bigger into the um, box that I've got but I'm going to put this netting stuff over the top and then train the plants could you try again? Siri I'm going to train the plants to come through the netting even if I have to cut it a little bit that's fine but I want to I want to stop basically the animals getting into this box because I think they're using it for a toilet I think they're digging for like things um, so yeah it's it's quite annoying so that's that's my plan my plan is to do that and I thought with the greenhouse thing um, the animals can't get into it and the fruit and veg will be okay but then I got um, I got quite a lot of this mesh stuff that I thought well even if I put pots into a corner I can then um, sort of cover it with the net so the, the animals can't get in because I know strawberries and that um, you have to like cover I bought strawberries as well um, and I know they might not flower this year or fruit this year they might fruit next year um, so we'll see how that goes and depending on how things go this year I might even get Ian to put up some hanging baskets like at the end of the day I know this is like communal property it's not our property we're told we can't really do much outside and stuff but I think if we maintain it and make it look pretty then what's the problem in that and we've had I've had these baskets out these um um uh, what they called flower bed things out there for a few years now since covid <clears throat> we've got table and chairs we've got a bench we've got pots out there it's just to make things look nice and plus if you've been with me for a while you will know that there is a leak out in our garden um, and they come and dug a trench and that trench is still covered over with wood and it is just thick mud it's horrible it's really really horrible um, so I might go out there tomorrow and do it if the weather's any good um, but I might do it at the weekend we'll see what the weather's like because yeah I don't want to do it in the rain and I don't want to do it when it's too windy there's no way I'm going to try and put up this greenhouse in the wind um, so yeah it's half past six I'm going no it's half past five Ian's on his way home from the unit I'm going to put some dinner on. We're having a chicken tea cut lasagna tonight. We had it before. It was really nice. And I might do some garlic bread with it. I might do a um, pita, um, rub it with some garlic and a little bit of cheese. I think that would be nice. So that's my plan. Um, I'm going to work on my C2C blanket tonight. That is what it is today, as I've changed my rotation a little bit. Um, but I think I've changed it for... The good <laughs> uh, and then tomorrow is my ranunculus so I'll get more work on my ranun ranunculus tomorrow uh, there's zoom tomorrow as well so I'll join that when I get back from the gym and sort myself out and everything um, yeah I'm looking forward to it I'm, I'm looking forward to going to the gym I'm looking forward to getting the garden sorted and I think because the weather is on the turn it's, it's getting me motivated a little bit more um, yeah, I've been wearing my Whitmore today, but I have got a blue top underneath. Don't really go, but hey-ho. Um, yeah, so I really love this. I, I just, oh, I still don't know about the sleeves. They've not bothered me today, actually. Not at all. They really haven't bothered me. Alexa, stop. Sorry about that. I put a timer on to preheat the oven. Um, yeah, the sleeves have not bothered me today, but I don't know whether that's because I haven't been as cold um so yeah i don't know um i'm going to end this vlog here if there is anything else that i vlog tonight i will put it here um to say keep watching <laughs> uh but i think that's it for tonight we're just gonna in enjoy our dinner uh probably watch some telly 
and yeah that's that's probably about it so thank you so much for watching I'm hoping these vlogs will get more interesting because I feel like they're really boring but then I watch them back and I'm like oh it wasn't too bad <laughs> um, see I don't really and I, I know I shouldn't copy other people or try to be like other people but I don't do like the montagey stuff and um, sometimes I do, sometimes in the, I'm in the mood and sometimes I'm not, but I'm just doing me, so you get me and that's it. So, I need to clear up up there as well, look, because there's medicine. Though I haven't got a cough anymore, yay! <laughs> My cough is gone. Um, I was really only coughing overnight, but that's, that's completely gone now. Right, I'm really going to go uh, rambling on. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog, and I shall see you tomorrow for tomorrow's vlog. Bye guys!